Hello Propeller fans, here are the changes to Propeller Tool version 2.6.0 released on December 8th, 2021. Floating point support has been added to the Spin2 compiler and also the debugger. This demo outputs floating point calculations and shows new operators and mnemonics. Also, sprite support has been added for the plot debug display. And if there's any debug displays that are not showing properly, there are these new constants that you can use to slow down the baud rate or delay the first debug action and perhaps get better response from your computer. In addition, if you're looking for some more help, the help menu has been enhanced to recategorize Propeller 1 and Propeller 2 resources. For example, to find debug features, scroll down here in the Spin Language documentation and search for debug in the table of contents. If you don't have the examples shown here, you may need to refresh your examples folder. To do that, open up Windows Explorer, go to Documents, Propeller Tool, and either rename or delete the examples folder. Then restart the Propeller Tool software, and it will automatically rebuild that examples folder.